Sparkle Squad, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Jasmine and welcome to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a workout for you guys, but this is going to be a little bit different than what you normally see because I'm going to be using my ice skates as weights and this is going to be really interesting. I have a lot of fun exercises that I can't wait to try to do with my ice skates. And it seems like it's going to be a lot of fun and I'm really excited. I also wanted to mention that these are actually my old skates and not my new ones because I guess I wanted to use my old ones instead of my new ones. But anyways, let's get started. So get your skates out and ready so we can continue our workout. Before we get started with the workout, we're going to warm up our muscles with a really short warm up. So the first thing that we're going to be doing is we're going to lie down on our backs like this and you're going to start off on either leg you want. I'm just going to start with holding my left leg and you're going to bring either of your legs to your chest like this and then your free leg, which is on the floor right now, you're going to pick it up and then you're going to lower it slowly to the ground and you want to make sure that it gets close enough to the ground but it doesn't completely touch and then you're going to lift it back up and you're going to repeat this on both legs 10 times each. Washed up, don't want to believe it. to believe it tough love you take it or leave it okay so once you do 10 on one leg you're going to switch your legs and do the other leg and what you want to make sure you to do while you're doing this is you want to have both of your feet pointed like this so just because you're not using this leg you still want to have the energy going through it so it's like it makes it harder so we're going to repeat this on the other leg Ten times. And that was our first warm-up exercise. The next exercise we're going to do is again we're going to be laying down and this time we're going to have both of our legs in the air and you want to make sure both of your toes are pointed and then you're going to lower each of your legs separately to the side so you want to have your arms up and then you're going to lower them to the side and the for this one it's best if your toes touch the floor because it's just better and you want to lower them each on each leg 10 times so a total of 20. Now we're going to do is we're going to stretch our arms so we're just going to take our arm and pull it across our body like this and we're going to hold it for 20 seconds on each side. Push 
Next we're going to do a quad stretch and we're going to do it on each leg and hold it for 10 seconds each side. Next what we're going to do is we're going to be, put our feet out in like second position and then turn our toes forward and we're going to lean over to the right, left, and then the middle and you're going to hold each side for 10 seconds. So now comes the fun part and now we can pick up our skates and start to use them as weights. So I have the rockers on my skates to protect me from not cutting my hand and then I'm holding it in like the middle part right here instead of like where the toe is. So I'm using the middle part. And the first exercise you're going to do is just like plain lift weights or weight lifting, I don't know exactly what it's called. But what we're going to do is you're going to lift them up regularly. So for me, since my heel are facing you guys down here, when I pull them up, the toes are facing you guys. And then you're going to do that. And on the second one, you're going to turn them. So you're going to twist them inwards like this. So for me, the toes are facing each other. So you're going to go one and then turn. And then you're going to repeat that 10 times. The next exercise we're going to do is I'm going to turn to the side so you guys can see it. But what we're going to do is we're going to put our skates or our weights above our head like this. And for me, the heels are facing that way and the toes are facing backwards. And then I'm going to lower them down and the toes touch my back. So you want to lower them as much as it touches your back. And you're going to lift them back up and you're going to repeat that 10 times. The next one we're going to do is we're going to do arm extensions to the back. So what you're going to do is you're going to slightly bend your knees and then lean over. And you want to try and keep your back as flat as you can. And then you're going to hold your skates at your hips with your elbows back like bent. And then you're going to straighten your arms to the back like this. And then bring it back and you're going to repeat that 10 times.
Now what we're going to do is we're going to hold our skates out in front of us like this. And then what we're going to do is we're going to bring it to our shoulders and then back out. And you're going to repeat this 10 times. This is what it looks like from the side. And then you're going to do that 10 times in a row. arm circles with our skates in our hands. So you're going to do 10 arm circles forward and then 10 arm circles backward. So this is what they look like. And you don't want to make them too big and you don't want to make them too small. So let's start. Now we're going to do squats with our skates. So you're going to hold them at your chest like this. You're going to squat and then when you stand up, you're going to push your skates up on your way up from the squat, if that makes any sense. But you're going to do this 10 times. The next exercise we're going to do is we're going to hold our skates in our hands and we're going to cross our arms across our chest like this with your toes stabbing you in the face <laughs> and then you're going to lower your back to flat really slow and then you're going to stand up quickly. So this is what it looks like from the side. And you're going to do that 10 times in a row. around your knees and then you're going to pull them up but on your way when you're pulling them up you're going to stand up and then you're going to go up onto your toes and then you're going to go back down and you're going to do this 10 times. exercise we're going to do is almost like the last one that we did, but this time we're going to add a squat. So you're going to go down, up to your toes, and then down to a squat. And then you're going to repeat that 10 times.
going to be doing lunges. So what we're going to do is we're going to have our skates next to our side. We're going to take either one of our legs, we have to do both of them anyways. Take it back and then go down into a lunge. Then come back up and repeat that on the other leg. We're going to do this 10 times. exercise you're going to do is you're going to lay down on our backs and we're going to go up into a hip bridge like this and we're going to bring one of our legs up level with the other leg and we're going to take our arms with our skates and we're going to bring them down and then up without moving our legs so we're going to do this 10 times on each leg Then we're going to repeat it on the other leg. Now what we're going to do is we are going to lay down back onto our back we're going to go into a hip bridge again and we are going to bring our arms up like this and then you're going to take out one of your legs it doesn't matter because you have to do both and you're going to lower and raise your free leg and you're going to do that 10 times and repeat it on both legs So we completed the workout and now we are going to do a cool down. The first stretch we're going to do is a pretzel stretch. So you're going to start with your feet out in front of you and you're going to choose it which leg you want to bring over. It doesn't matter, you have to do both. And I'm just going to bring it over and you want to have it around where your knee is. And you're going to twist in the direction of that leg. So since I have my right leg up, I'm going to twist to the right you're going to have your hands on the outside and it's like a twist for your back and you're going to hold this for 10 seconds on each leg. Now we're going to do a pigeon pose. So what you're going to do is you're going to have your back leg straight and you're going to take your opposite leg and put it in front of you with it bent almost. And the straighter you can get it to like the more of a right angle you could get it in front of you, the better. And then you wanna to try to lean over and you're going to do this on each leg for 10 seconds each.
cobra stretch, which is almost like a plank. So you're going to go into a plank, and then you're going to lower your hips to the ground, and you're going to push up yourself up with your arms, almost like you're doing a layback position on the ice. And you want to hold this for 10 seconds. is we're going to do a child's pose. The easiest way to get into this position is from a cobra, like what we did before. So you're going to go from a cobra and you're going to push your hips all the way to the back and you're going to have your arms stretched out in front of you and you're going to let your head down to the ground. You're going to hold this for 10 seconds. I hope you guys enjoy. I want you guys to comment down below if you guys want to see more workout routines with skates because they're a lot of fun to do. Especially if you don't have weights, you can just use your skates. Anyways, also don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. Love you guys. Bye!